Law number 31. Control the options. Get others to play with the cards you deal. Always give people a sense of how things will fall apart without you. It's a law. Always give people a sense of how things will fall apart without you. That is why prophets, whenever they come to you, false prophets, they will come to you and they will create a spiritual problem that is not there. And after they create a spiritual problem that is not there, they will come back and tell you, but I can solve it for you. <laughs> for example, a false prophet will meet you and tell you, I'm seeing there are seven witches in your village. It's a lie. He's just creating a problem that is not there so that you can be dependent on him. Many of you right now are in prisons. You are living in prisons of uh, certain false and fake prophecies you are, uh, that you have received in the past. You are imprisoned because of prophecies. You are imprisoned because a, a, a false prophet told you at some point that they are bewitching you in your family. Now the next thing you know, you can't meet, you can't see eye to eye with your family. You can't see eye to eye with your people simply because there is a false prophet who told you that the witch is your mother, the witch is your grandmother, the witch is your grandfather. Do you really think that if your mother was a witch, she was going to allow you to grow up to this age? If she was a witch, she would have killed you the day that she got pregnant of you. Don't allow these false prophets to lie to you. That your mother is the witch. I'm seeing that your, your father is the witch. Do you think your father, if really your father, let me just be brutal for a second. If your father was a witch, the day that you were sleeping with your mother, he was going to pull out. Why would you waste his energy and waste nine months of pregnancy? Sim only to come and bewitch you when you are 25 years old. What's so special about you now? Don't lie to this, uh, don't listen to this false prophet. They are lying prophets from the pit of hell. They are not of God. They are not called by God. They speak lying divinations and lying visions according to Ezekiel chapter 13. They do not speak from a place of, uh, of, uh, of Christ, but they speak from a place of hunger. There's nothing in the stomach. Therefore, they create problems that are not there. There are many of you who are watching me right now. You were told, uh, uh, this one is a witch and this one is wicked this one is wicked stay away from this one stay away from this one my friend you have you have abandoned a lot of people who have helped you right now simply because you are naive and gullible okay so always give people a sense of how things will fall apart without them that is why many prophets will tell you that my covering that is upon your life false prophet there is no covering that can sustain anybody. Only the covering of Christ can sustain you. Only God's covering upon your head can sustain you. They will tell you that now that you have left my covering, you are going to be cursed. Oh, it's, it's, it's a lie. There's nothing like that. Don't listen to those things. They are lies. The next time you hear that, open your mouth and tell them you lie. You lie. You are liars. <laughs>